Okay guys, we are in Albania, in Tirana, and it's just amazing. So beautiful. I'm so surprised. I'm so happy that we are here. Actually, I didn't build too much expectations and I had no idea what is waiting for us. It's surprising. Look at this one. Hey guys, so uh, hi from Albania, it's Tirana. Actually, it's our last day in Albania and uh, we're staying in such a beautiful house. Uh, take a look to this view. We have mountains view directly from here and uh, it makes me so happy. Uh, also, there are some different types of uh, local buildings. It looks um, different, not we, uh, which we get used to see. And it also makes me happy because I like to see different cultures and it makes me like a full feel. Uh, so, right now we are standing on a balcony and I would like to make you a short house tour and uh, as you might see behind me, the kitchen. So it's a really smart uh, decision to make like that. The kitchen may be small but we have everything, basically everything, all like dishes, everything to cook and it's uh, amazing. If we would stay here one month, we will not need anything. <laughs> we could live here for sure and uh, this is like so light and this light comes slightly to the room so let's go i will show you the room uh, as you can see this room uh, is totally white as i love <laughs> because i don't know in ukraine somehow uh, people have a problem to make white apartments that's why maybe it's so much basic for US, us people or for european people but for me as a ukrainian i miss it everywhere i i don't know i don't know why our people make some like wallpaper with a button and uh, like leopard button <laughs> Huh? Leopard type of <laughs> Leopard is uh, like rare to find, but you can find it, <laughs> yes. And um, yeah, this is like, as you can see, Scandinavian style, uh, also minimalistic, which I love so much because they're like natural textures, like of the wood. And um, let's see, what do we have? We have a perfect bed, uh, slight decoration on the top. Uh, here is the coach. Actually, to have a coach here, it's a big benefit because when you have just uh, just a bed, you like during the day you want to have a rest. You don't want to go all the, to the bed, right, all the time. So coach is super good and comfortable. Maybe even it can be open, and here could stay one more person. No, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Uh, in front of the bed, there is a big TV, some shelf. And at this side, I really like this uh, round Scandinavian style table and chairs, really comfortable, even with the pillows. So it's so nice to have here breakfast or to do your work. And uh, in this corner, we also have a, uh, this super stylish wardrobe. It's uh, really done from the good material. I don't know, it's very just nice to touch. Maybe it's like a uh, custom made. And uh, as you can see, it can make a decoration in your room if you put everything like accurate <laughs> uh, and uh, very functional. So it's super cool. So basically, we are really happy uh, to stay here and we are a bit regretting that it's just only one night because this house uh, could be used for a long term for sure. It uh, has a perfect light. We can uh, like feel happy here you know this is a good vibe good air and the mountain view so at this side we have a bathroom uh, bathroom is uh, basic but all we need sink shower toilet mirror and a water heater so we have a hot water which is a good use <laughs> um, so yes actually i was uh, not able to make videos in albania we uh, have uh, been here for 10 days and this is our last one so we started our trip also from tirana and uh, this trip actually was so cool and it reminds me of old times uh, because it was pretty easy to enter the country uh, 
they don't request now PCR test. They are like uh, really uh, warm welcoming tourist uh, people here, and uh, it was like really easy. It was short flight. It was nice to fly directly from Kharkiv, from a uh, city where we live now with Engin, with my husband. And uh, yeah, it was so cool, nice, uh, and uh, different experience. And since we came to Tirana, I felt right away. Uh, such a good vibe I don't know I, I was missing this also type of culture it's uh, a bit uh, closer to Europe and uh, they are also located close to it Italy uh, also when we went to the um, downside uh, south uh, seaside uh, it's uh, really close to Greece and uh, what I like so much that here is like a cuisine like mix mixture of Italy, a uh, mixture of Greece and uh, also Turkey. I was surprised actually, I, I had no idea uh, to be honest that um, Albania was influenced by Turkey before, like for 500 years and of course it's affected and some people are speaking Turkish, they're like a Turkish food and it's uh, really really uh, uh, delicious um, everywhere. So I don't know, my, my soul was so much happy here. Also the prices are so good because you have like amazing uh, food also like close and European style restaurants and you pay there like in Ukraine we will pay uh, so I don't say that it's cheap it's also like of course it's um, uh, cost some money but it's much much cheaper than if you will go to Italy or you will go to some European countries so it's worth to visit this place for sure and uh, I can say it's also uh, really nice for digital nomads because uh, first of all you have a good internet you can go for different coffee shops work there and when you have a free time you can uh, you can go to the seaside or you can go to mountains so basically you have here everything i i also would like to say that it's a uh, we are in june and june is not so busy so it's really good it's not so hot not so busy and it's nice to enjoy it so locals say that uh, july august will be crowded but who knows with these corona times i don't think that it will be so much crowded to be honest but maybe it will come better and better and uh, yeah to tourism will come back to to this country as well so this is it guys uh, i unfortunately i couldn't make too many videos because we saw so many beauty around and we were facing some little bit problems uh, because um, engin had a bit problem with his uh, leg uh, we couldn't go so much around but I can say that in these 10 days anyway we were inspired so much and we definitely actually from the first day we understood that we will um, love to come back here and enjoy and discover it more so we also met actually nice people we had a good uh, good time together and um, if uh, somebody of you is still thinking that Albania could be dangerous it's a myth uh, don't believe that please and uh, feel free feel uh, safe to come and travel to this beautiful country thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video bye bye